Hey, Iron Toast here. This month is chock full of stuff to do. Event quests uh, from last month and the upcoming month and overlapping things. And uh, let's take a look at all of it real briefly and talk about what you should do in what order to get it all done. So when you open up your game for this month's uh, set of event quests, it is absolutely mind-blowing how much stuff they expect you to get due this month. Um, so let's take a look at what you should do, maybe, uh, in what order, <clears throat> to really maximize what's going on. So the first thing is, dungeons are still running through the rest of this week and the first couple days next week. I always recommend doing dungeons, simply because the resources are really good, um, especially the gold. And if you're into the shards to get the four or five star uh, heroes, then, you know, go for that too. I do, because at, at the very least, if it's not a new five star for you, you get uh, shards, six star crystal shards. The second thing are the negative zone quests. These are going to go on for a little bit longer too. These hand out T2 alpha fragments and four and five star and six star crystal shards like candy. You have to keep doing these. I mean, I know it's a lot of energy. You're probably going to be spending units on energy this month, but they are a must. They are just too easy. Um, now, so for the rest of these new three things, right, there's this last stand uh, for the, the quest for the stones. There's the last stand, save the battle realm, and the Avengers Forever. The Avengers Forever is the normal event quest that we get every month, right? It's, now it's, it's a little difficult, especially that Thanos at the very end, but, uh, you know, I would save this probably uh, for, you know, get these other things out of the way first and save this one for when you have extra energy to get through because it's it's a 42-day quest total. You have plenty of time. You know, don't don't be too lazy on it, but you need to get it done. But most importantly, first thing you can do is get these. These other two goes together, right? The quest for the stones and save the battle realm. What it is is every week you'll get a new quest for a stone one of the infinity stones this week it was the soul stone so starting next week probably wednesday it'll be the mind stone and then so forth there's two each in each of these chapters you basically have to fully explore any level you can even do the easy one and you get the soul stone the soul stone gets equipped to you for the rest of the month it's up here and what it does is it beefs up captain america uh, the original captain america and uh, each stone will do a different one of those um, original six avengers and uh, so what's going to happen is you take that soul stone, it's already equipped, you don't have a choice, and then you go into these maw quests, right? And you can only take one champion, so it's designed to be whoever has the stone that got new that week. So and we're going to try that. We're going to go to the epic quest, and I'll show you. You only get to take one person. We're going to take Captain America, and we're going to do the soul stone path. <clears throat> You'll notice once you go in here, there are six different paths to go down. One, two, three, four, five, six. They all end on Ebony Maw. And then when you go up to this portal, it'll tell you <clears throat> A, B, C, D, E, F. And then it'll, it'll be, so Soul Stone, Mind, see here it is, Reality, Time, Power, Space. So we're going to take the Soul Stone. And, and basically, the stone is designed to overpower that Avenger for that week um, to help you get through these quests. So this Juggernaut here is cornered. Strike back, power reserve. Uh, what do we have here? Degeneration. Oh, fun. Um, oppression. Okay, so basically, uh, and you, basically with him, that power reserve, one of the things that the soul stone does for you is it helps you power lock him. So that's going to be very important. This would be very difficult to do without uh, that stone. Practically impossible. It's designed to be impossible. So let's take a look at this juggernaut. Uh, so again, real, real quick, he's got degeneration, which is no fun. Now I gain one health, 1% 1 health per second, but I'm losing 1.10% health per second. So, uh, luckily I can gain some health. I should be able to keep it near the top, um, because of the power stone, excuse me, the soul stone. And, uh, basically you really only want to attack this guy when you've got him power locked. He power locks, uh, when you parry him sometimes, and I'll show you that. Now you can't do it off the bat here because he uh, his unstoppable will cause stagger but now see I don't want to hit him yet I really want to hit that really really want to get that uh, power lock is what I want there it is 
because you really only want to hit them when you've got them power locked. At this point, I need to just create some room. Now, when he is fatigued, this is a really tough fight. Okay. Obviously, he kicked my butt. Um, so he goes he goes at you hard. Uh, basically, and it's going to be really tough, but what you want to see, and I know that was a terrible example. Maybe I'll get another one at some point. But what you're going to want to do, watch this power or soul stone here. Here we go. So if you look here, where does he go? Fatigue. So each time the opponent is fatigued, power lock the opponent for three seconds. So he can fatigue when he attacks into your block. That's all a good fight, and sometimes that happens when you parry. I was getting some really bad luck there. Um, when I was fighting a lot of other <clears throat> quests, it, it came so easy just to get the power lock. It was like every single time he parried. For some reason, he's not really doing it here. So uh, anyway, I'll try and get a better video of that, but that's the gist of it, okay? Do the negative zone quests, do the dungeons while they're on. Those will end soon, and then you can focus on the quest for the stones, and then beat the Ebony Maw quests, and then whenever you have that extra time, go ahead and knock out those... Uh, those monthly event quests, quests, the Thanos. So anyway, um, I will try to get a better video of that juggernaut um, and maybe the Dormammu after that. So um, thanks for watching, guys, and I will catch you later. Bye.